This is NBC6, South Florida Today. He's lighting the torch right as we speak. His cooking utensil is the kind you find in a garage. Chef Chris Kides, is that how you pronounce it? Kides. Kides, okay. She cooks Mediterranean food with a new flair and calls himself the Flaming Greek. Chris? Well, thank you for having me. All right, we're very glad you're here. And it's, the stuff has been smelling up the studio with this incredible aroma already for about an hour. And um, you, you've got a lot of stuff done here, but it looks like you still got a lot more to do. Well, what we're doing today is going to be a Grecian um, black sea um, chicken. And what I'm doing is stuffing it with um, some feta cheese, some spinach, and some red bell peppers. So what I'm going to do is start out real quick, and I just want to make the audience understand that when you're doing you know, things in the way of cooking, you've got to season things in, in a proper amount. So I'm going to do a rub down, right. and this is some Greek seasoning is what it is. Just take it and just rub it on down and don't be afraid. And I always um, urge people out there in TV land that this is the basis. You know what I'm saying? Use your taste buds. Add what you want to add as well. I'm just, just doing the basis. So what I'm doing is just hollowing this thing out. I'm just getting a cavity in here just to start with. So what we're going to do is just stuff the feta in here uh -huh. and the red bell peppers and the spinach. So we got that done over here, and we're going to season it down real good. Try to get something in there because it's all about the flavor. And you got to be willing to be hands-on if you're going to be a good chef. Well, yeah, and you I know mean, what you it is. You got to get your hands dirty here. Correct. You get your hands dirty, but see, I grew up in a traditional Greek family, and Yaya is grandmother in Greek, and um, it's all about the taste. It's it's all about you can taste and and, and see what's going on in here. So what I'm going to do is just. Excuse me. Sure. I'm going to grab sure. this. I'm going to heat up go. this pan real good. Turn it up to heat a bit. So we're going to get the pan hot. Do not try this at home. All right, so we got that hot. Got a nice little stand over here for this. And we're just going to cut this pepper up real quick, any which way you want to do it. Now you got the red pepper and you also got the orange pepper. I think one's sweeter than the other. Which is sweeter? I think that the orange is uh, the most orange sweeter. is the most expensive one. It's more than the green. Well, the, 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 the red's more store. traditional. It's about you know three dollars and something yeah. dollars a pound. But um, you know it's all color. It's all presentation. Put a little olive oil in this pan here. Oop, a little smoke. Oh well. No one else has ever gotten a pan this hot. Well, we got a big studio here. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to get this hot real quick. I'm going to throw a few things of garlic in here. Chop it up real fine. And a little butter. All right, so just let that sit there for a little while. Throw a little spinach in here. And I got a little chicken broth. Looking good. Sounding good, too. Smells good. The whole studio is getting up. And we'll go Careful, Kelly. Watch your step. Okay, so we got this down over here. What we're going to do is just move on. Get these out of here. All right, this is what you got when you're done. Do you and do now, this table side with the torch or no Table or side. I'm going to start four restaurants, one in L.A., one in Miami, one in Orlando. Flame and Greek. Wow. And everybody's going to be using a torch. All right, so quickly, just take this, and we're just going to take what we have in here with a little feta cheese. So a piece in here. We've got about a minute. Okay. God, I feel like I've walked into hell. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm going to lose my hair. All right, so just mix this up real quick. Chris, huh? And what you want to do is just get some feta in here <laughs> and some red bell pepper. And just repeat the process. you got a little um, spinach. 
and get both sides. These are big chicken breasts, yeah, as you get to see. Because usually what they do is just take it, cut it in half, and you get one on one. Oh, it's really good, Chris. Yeah. So you're stuffing you're that add, underneath the skin? Is that what you're doing? Yeah. Oh, yeah, get wow. it right in there. You hollow it out. And then we'll just stick this on over here. Blowtorch comes in handy at home, too, if you got Blow torch is the calluses. best thing. Yeah. So this is stuffed Grecian chicken. And as I did say, you got some feta. you got some different types of red bell pepper with some olive oil, garlic. Chris, you finish up. Let me tell our viewers that if they want to know more about your blowtorch technique, just log on to her website at NBC6.net. <laughs> <laughs> You're Looking good. And you're right. handsome, too. Well, thank you. You're and welcome. You the blowtorch. Yeah. I have to say that you're armed. <laughs> well, everybody for watching. We'll see you on the news in two minutes. Have a good one, everyone. All right, then. Good. All right, let's go. All right, you guys going to eat now, correct? You. Well, i got to do another show. But after I'll that, eat four Bob. Great. I love that. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. So I would love to try it.